Hi, and welcome to another video recipe in my series Quick, Simple, Easy for One Meals. In this video, I'm making pepperoni and ham pizza using frozen pizza dough, thawed of course, and I'll put a link to it in the description box below. To start with, just dust the work surface with some fine ground um, semolina or flour or combination of flour and semolina, it doesn't really matter. I thawed the dough ball in its packaging for eight hours at room temperature. Just dust the dough ball lightly before you start. It'll make life easier a little bit later on. Ease the dough ball out of the packaging. It'll be a little bit sticky, but it's, it's okay. Just, uh, um, now just give it another little dusting uh, with, with the flour and semolina and you'll find that everything will be fine. Dust the rolling pin and start pushing the dough out into an approximate shape resembling the, the air fryer basket. Keep rolling until the dough is the approximate shape you're looking for. Use the crisper plate to help shape the dough. Adjust the size of the dough if need be and then you're all ready to go. One final check for size and your pizza base will be ready. The pizza base is pretty much there now. So just trim off any excess, uh, any excess dough. Uh, use the use the crisper plate as a template, and you'll be able to fit the dough straight into the air fryer basket. Just a quick tidy up of the um, semolina flour. Now place the pizza base into the air fryer basket and you'll find it will fit pretty much there. I've made a simple tomato sauce and I'll put the, the recipe in the description below. Basically I've used a tin of finely chopped tomatoes, a teaspoon of onion powder, a teaspoon of garlic powder, a tablespoon of olive oil and a teaspoon of sugar and that is my basic tomato sauce. Here you can see I'm using sliced mozzarella cheese and just breaking it into pieces but you can quite easily use grated mozzarella it works just as well. You can add any toppings of your choice really uh, I'm, I'm using pepperoni and ham that's my preference, I like that savoury, spicy taste. Moving over to the air fryer, there's no need to preheat, just set the temperature at 180 degrees Celsius and the time for 10 minutes. If you want a crispier based pizza, set the temperature at 185 degrees Celsius and 10 minutes cooking time is the same as, the, uh, as before. Ooh, is that looking good or what? pizza comes out of the basket with no problems whatsoever. Now all that's left to do is to slice it up 
and eat it. Wow. This has got to be the easiest and quickest pizza recipe on YouTube. Enjoy. Absolutely delicious. 10 minutes. Brilliant. It's gorgeous.